What's up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. We're back at it with more Emerge NYC gameplay. We're back on the Brooklyn map and uh, we're running with the NYPD right now. We're going to be seeing what we can get into with the NYPD. Basically, we're just going to respond to a few calls, something like that. Nothing major. There's not a whole lot you can do on here as the NYPD other than to give this uh, jackleg a ticket right here for holding up uh, traffic. What are you doing, dude? Come on, seriously. I, I don't know what he's doing. The school bus driver is uh, doesn't need to be driving a school bus, evidently. And this guy's just getting all up on me. What are you people doing? Do you not see the lights? Oh, 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 I see something. I see something we need to check out right now. We need to check this out. I see a no-no. So y'all need to stop and respect the lights. Do you not see me? I'm policing here. <laughs> We're policing the neighborhood. Uh, this dude, well, I, I don't know. Maybe he's not blocking the hydrant. I thought he was a little bit close on it, but I guess not. Let's hop out and look and see real quick. I, I don't know how much you're allowed. Like that's a little bit close to me right here. That's a little bit close. What do you guys think? Let me know. That's a little, I mean, he's out of the red area. He's like right there on it. He's lucky. I don't know how he managed to park there and not <laughs> like get it that close. So I guess, I guess we'll let it slide. I, I don't know. That's pretty dang close to me. There's not a lot of room there. I like to see a little bit uh, more room around my hydrants on my beat, but We'll uh, we'll do the we'll do him a solid. We'll do him a solid and let him get away with it. All right, let's uh, go ahead and hit reverse, and we'll see what else we can find in Brooklyn. We're in Brooklyn, New York. We're checking out the neighborhood over here. You know, you guys, you got to patrol the neighborhood, and everyone is just wanting to stop. They see a police officer and they're like freaking out, <laughs> and people they're getting nervous. It's like in real life when you have a police car come up behind you. You know, knowing you haven't done anything wrong, like you haven't done a single thing wrong, everything's okay. <laughs> but when they get behind you, you turn into like the extra good driver, right? And that's what they're doing. They're like, we're just gonna let him get on by. All right, let's let's uh, let's continue our patrol. We'll see what else we can find and uh, maybe we'll take some calls too. Man, there's lots of hydrants around here everywhere. No one's blocking them. All right, we're cruising neighborhood. Got a call for a car fire. So we're going to respond to that. Check it out. See what it looks like. We've had multiple people call it in. So let's see. Let's make this left. And uh, we'll head that way. Should be just right up here, correct? Oh, where are you at? On down, on down. All right, y'all get out of the way. Y'all going to have to go. Look at the lights, though. Don't they look good? What are you doing, dude? Well, my traffic's back. They're back. I, I don't know what I did to fix that. I haven't done anything to fix it, actually. They're just back. They're back with a vengeance. I don't know what they're doing. Come on. What are you guys doing? Like, they're so bad. <laughs> they're so incredibly bad. They're losing their mind. They don't know what to do. All right, let's go on. They just refuse to move. They're like, we're sitting right here, buddy. Oh, here we are. Yeah, okay. Um, is this a one-way street? I think it is. Yeah, it looks like it. All right, let's, uh, no, dude, really? You want to drive your, car or your Corvette by that? <laughs> It'll melt your fiberglass in no time. All right, let's go ahead and park here. And uh, we'll wait on New York Fire Department to get here. All right, let's do a little traffic controls here, guys. You guys need to get off the road. We gotta do some traffic control. My really bad New York accent. I do it because I love you guys. <laughs> they say impersonation is the biggest form of flattery. I just feel it. I feel it in my bones. Oh, it's going good though. I need to, oh, here they come. There's a uh, crazy ladder one two three is here. Wow, they beat the engine. How did that happen? I hope two three four decides to show up sometime because the ladder isn't going to do anything. 
There they are. There they are. Nice, nice. Oh, they're so loud. Turn down a little bit. Looks good rolling down the street. Alright, sweet. There we go. They're here. Nice little scene going here. Not too bad. Not too bad. Got our uh, police unit and the ladder and the uh, engine, so... We'll go with that. Let's get a uh, let's get a good let's get a screenshot here. All right. At this point, we're, we are going to have to hop over on the uh, FDNY side, so uh, let's do that. Go ahead and hop on engine two, three, four, and we'll get started doing all the things. We'll get our spot line. I have to relearn this stuff. And that you know as you go back and forth in between games you kind of have to relearn it it trips you up a little bit all right let's grab hydrant wrench got him night time is the right time i always say that night time is the right time for flashing lights all right let's drop you here and we'll grab quick attack we'll do that uh where are you at what is it q yes it is q okay uh, charge shutdown line, pump quick attack line, okay. And then let's do this. Nice, I think I finally figured out the quick attack. I don't know why it has that extra option to, um, to, uh, charge the line or pump or whatever it is. It's just, it's kind of odd. Alright, let's go ahead and... I cannot remember how to crouch down. There we go. All right, that would be Z. We're getting it. Someone's uh, <laughs> someone's van is done going up in flames. Looks like one of those creepy vans. All the time pulling up on the street corner asking to give candy away. All right, I think we got this kind of knocked down pretty quick. I keep hitting control because... I keep uh, trying to crouch and uncrouch. Now we got it. All right, let's go back around to the front here. We'll get him. Oh, that's all we've got. The quick attack never has enough line. Never. It never has enough. All right. Um, yeah, let's put him back. That's why I don't use the quick line, or quick attack line that much. Let's put him back. Let's put him back. Let's go to regular, regular attack line. I know people all the time leave comments, you should use a quick attack line. And I know there's like, I'm like, oh yeah, okay, we'll do that. But then I always remember later on, I'm like, that's why I don't use the quick attack line because it's never long enough. Never long enough for what you need. Uh, it looks like it went out the rest of the way, actually, so we don't even really need this, but we'll, uh, we'll pull it anyway. All right, let's drop you down here, and we'll hook it up to the front end on two, three, four. Now we're set. I think we are. Get our light going so we can see. We don't do a lot of nighttime stuff on here, and it's not for any particular reason other than it just defaults to day when you start, so. Alright, let's put a little extra water on it here. Get some in the grill. Cool. Get up under there too, just in case there's a little gas or fuel or anything. We'll get that for good measure. I think this one's pretty much done, though. I think we've done a good job. We saved the day. All right, smoke's dissipated. We'll get packed up, and uh, we'll swap back over to the NYPD and finish up our uh, night beat now. All right, there you go. One, two, three is leaving out. They're heading back to the station. All's been taken care of. Uh, NYPD towing is going to come take care of that van. And we'll hop back in our, uh, vehicle here and continue to patrol the city. All 
All right, let's go. Let's see what else we can get into here. It's not a lot. There's not much you can do as the police in game. I, I keep looking forward to that. I don't know why we're stopping. We got the light. I don't even really, I kind of disregard lights. Honestly, I don't pay a lot of attention to them, but not a lot you could do. I wish we could at least like uh, give parking tickets or s something like that. Just a little something to do, you know? Kind of uh, occupy your time. I keep thinking I'm going to find someone parked in front of a hydrant. We've we've done that. We've come across that all the time as like on the fire trucks. You see that all the time, but <laughs> in uh you know, on the NYPD side, you don't ever find them. Like I don't know where they're at. We don't have we don't have any tail lights. Interesting. Let's notice that. All right, well we're checking out all the hydrants on the map. Everything looks good so far. The the hydrants are okay. At least they seem to be. They're everywhere. There's so many hydrants everywhere. I, I do think, I, in all you know, seriousness, I think they do need to call back the hydrants just a little bit. Maybe it's like that up here in Brooklyn, in New York. Maybe they have the uh, the pleasure of having a hydrant everywhere. But man, there's a bunch of them. They're literally on every corner. All right, let's keep going. Kind of nice just cruising around um, and nothing going on. No, let's check this guy. No, he's not on it. It's close. It's kind of close, but like, you look at it from a distance like that. It looks really close, but no cigar. We, we're not going to be able to issue any parking tickets. I just knew we would. All right, we're back. We've got a call for a, a structure fire. Somewhere around here. May, what are you doing? You, <laughs> they just don't care. They really don't. Like if, if, if you're trying to go through an intersection, trying to clear an intersection, they'll stop and they'll just sit there. But if you're in the intersection, they'll just, uh, they'll T-bone you. It makes no sense. These people just, they don't know how to drive. All right, let's get on down here real fast. All right, I think we can swing back up now. It's going to be one block over. Man, those lights look so good at night, though. They really just do. All right, where is she going to be at? Up here somewhere. Let's see. Uh, Yeah, there we go. There it is right there. All right, let's, oh, we got our first ticket right here too. Oh, buddy, you done bought yourself a ticket. For real, you have got a ticket, dude. We'll go down there and check it out in just a second. All right, what well, we did, we just swung the block. We're gonna park here on the corner and do some traffic control and uh, wait on the uh, fire department to get here. When they do, we're gonna go down there and give that dude a fake ticket. We're gonna role play a ticket. Cause he done messed up. He parked on the hydrant. I knew there'd be one somewhere. All right, let's get uh, the fire department here. Let's go check the scene out real quick while we wait on the fire department. The boys from the FDNY are on their way and we're going to get this dude to take it down here because he parked all up on that hydrant. Yes, he did. Oh, dude, that's a no-no. You messed up. I wonder how much that would cost you. I don't know. I've never had a ticket like that. I've had plenty of speeding tickets, but I have never had a uh, any kind of parking violation, so I don't know. I don't know. I've had some fairly pricey tickets in the past, though, but not anything like that. Oh, man, it's going good in here. All right, there's uh, one, two, three is here. Man, they're Johnny on the spot today. They get here ASAP. They do. They are not messing around. Oh, it's really going in there. Yeah. You're like, is there anyone in there? Hello. Hello. New York Police Department. Uh, I don't think I've ever rolled up on this fire before, honestly. Does he have a light? No, he doesn't have a light. He doesn't have any kind of a light. All right. Uh, two, three, four. You can get here any time now, dude. Would be nice. There he is. All right, let's hop over. We'll go to the other side now. Yeah, right, here we go. We're not bringing a whole lot of stuff. We're just going to do these two. 
and jump right on the fire. I'm worried if we brought another, you know, a whole bunch of other equipment, it would just, uh, it would allow the fire to burn out. We don't want that to happen. We want to put water on the fire. Now let's get this guy. And let's get the hydrant on. Let's see. What is the ladder? What do we need to do with him, maybe? I really think we need to go on and hit it with the attack line. Let's do that. Let's jump on it real fast. Real fast. See if we can do something good here. Pull the attack line. Just, just go to stretch it manually. We're not going to do the uh, free links or whatever you want to call it. It always wigs out on me. Come on. Go, Williams. Go. Pull. <laughs> Pull, dude. He's so slow. He's having a hard time today. We just need to get some cardio in, dude. Hey, he is he's having a really hard time? Why is he? Why is he having such a hard time? Like he can't? Maybe it's because I it's because I haven't played this in a while. Uh, let's get our Gatorade. There we go. Got us some Gatorade, and we'll get our line. Look you on the front here. Two, three, four, one, two, three. My absolute favorites on the Brooklyn map. All right, let's go ahead and charge it. Nice, there we go. Now we're making some headway. We're gonna knock this down real fast. Let's get upstairs too. Oh, it looks good. Nighttime, right? It looks good for certain. Alright, I think we're getting a good knock on it, guys. I think we are. I had grabbed some more uh, screenshots there. I don't ever do action screenshots. It's like I never think about it. I never think about action screenshots because I'm always so uh, so busy putting wet stuff on red stuff, right? Put someone uh, set on my TikToks. I hear that a lot. Because that's what it's all about when, it's <laughs> when it comes down to it. About getting water on the fire. I think we got a really good knock on this. I do believe there's some more in there. Let's get our air going. Yeah, I don't think I've done this fire before. I really it doesn't seem very familiar to me. All right, I think there's going to be fire in the walls here. Oh, she's lagging up on me. Please don't lock up. All right, there we go. She froze up for a second. I don't know what that was about. I think we knocked it down already. I think we got a really good knock on this, guys. At least it seems that way. Yeah, I think we did, man. I think it's just in the wall down here. Let's see. Let's get our uh, let's get our light going. And we'll spray this wall really good here. We'll spray it. Yeah, I hear it. I hear it in there. I just don't see it. I think we got it. I think we're good. Let's drop this down right here. And let's grab, uh, let's grab a pike. Can we knock it down? Yes, we can. And there's our fire. I knew it. I heard it. I felt it with my bones. Knew we had some fires in there. Let's tear all the things up first. There we go. <laughs> We're taking the sheetrock down, the two by fours out. We're completely demolishing this house. You got to when you got some hidden fires up in there. You can't be too careful, you know. Oh, <laughs> breaking glass. Get this too. That looked like that might be a little iffy as well. Let's get our air off because running out and we're going to die. <laughs> we don't want to die. 
Let's get all this stuff tore down. All right, there we go. I think we're good. Let's head back out. We'll drop you. We'll pick up the line. We'll put some more water on it real fast. All right, Mr. Williams, do your thing, dude. There we go. Super fast. All right, let's hop back up. We'll go grab our pike. We'll do a little bit more uh, overhaul inside, and then we'll probably see about calling it on this one. Still got that little bit of random lag here and there. It's kind of spotty lag. Yeah, I don't. I think we're good. I don't hear anything. I've always said we should have the, I mean, we've got a sense of smell because it says odor none. I feel like if there's any kind of fire burning, you should smell smoke, you know, should always. I think that should be another clue to, uh, you know, what's going on. Yeah, I think we're good. I think we're good here. We'll check the cock loft. <laughs> it always cracks me up. I don't know how that term came about, but it's funny. There we go. Uh, it doesn't look like anything up there. Can we pull this one down too? Yes, we can. Let's pull it down. Not letting us get all the sheetrock though. I was wanting to double check it to make sure there's no fire up there, but make sure there's no fires. Uh, yeah, we're kind of getting it a little bit. To me, like, doing overhaul on a fire scene is next level firefighting gameplay. I, I really, I really, really enjoy this. Yeah, just not everything wants to, uh, not everything wants to pull, right? Only kind of spottiness here. Either way, I think we're good. I think we're good here. <laughs> we completely gutted that room. <laughs> There's like nothing left. That's hilarious. Love it. Let's go ahead and take the rest of Sheerock now. I mean, while we're at it, this is a room that actually really burns, so. May as well check it all out. Nice. Oh, come on. We got a little bit of Sheerock left. We can't leave that. We got to get it all, every single bit of it. Come on, a few more pieces here. There we go, nice. We got it completely, completely gutted now, right? Completely, except maybe over the door. What, we can't have that. <laughs> We've got a random piece of sheetrock still hanging. We can't have that. Ah, oh, I, wish, I wish my cursor would lock to the screen. That's one thing, uh, cursor drift over to your second monitor. It happens to me all the time. It will drift over to the second monitor. Uh, I wish the cursor would somehow just lock to the game. I mean, I know Alt does that. It takes the cursor away, but uh, it's still an issue. It's it's still an issue. There we go. We got that. And I think we got some more right here, too. Yep, we do. Oh, it popped back up. What the heck? It's possessed. Got a mind of its own. There we go. Nice. <laughs> we ripped everything out. We just got a few studs left, and that's it. Very nice. Oh, it's back again. What the hell? It keeps coming back. All right. Well, that, uh, that piece of sheetrock is possessed. Anyway, this was a really good response. I think we did a good job, guys. We saved the building. It's only, uh, it was contained to, uh, part of the downstairs, part of the upstairs. Looks like maybe like one room, something like that. Anyway, that's going to do it for this one. Thank you all for watching. I really do appreciate it. Love all you guys. You're absolutely awesome. You're such a great community. I really do appreciate it. If you are new to the channel, please be sure to hit that like, subscribe, ring that bell, leave me a comment, share it with your friends, your grandparents, your parents, your brothers, your sisters, everyone sharing is caring and it does help uh, the channel a lot, believe it or not. 
And with all that said, we will catch you on the streets of Brooklyn next time. Peace.